Well, here's the draw for the second round. Scarborough play Southampton. Sunderland have been drawn against Huddersfield. Wigan play Sheffield United. Barnsley play Blackpool. Hull must play First Division QPR. It's Leighton Orient or Northampton against Sheffield Wednesday. Grimsby play First Division Aston Villa. And Brantford City play First Division West Ham. And Leeds have been drawn against Scunthorpe. The first legs of those ties will be played in the week beginning September the 23rd. The Scunthorpe gave just as good as they got. And when David Batty's generosity set up Ian Helliwell, the night could have turned out very awkward indeed for Leeds. Scunthorpe nil, Leeds nil. John Lukic had to be at his very best to deny Scunthorpe's Tony Dawes. In fact, for the first hour, Scunthorpe made a mockery of the supposed difference in class, and it was only a controversial penalty that broke the deadlock. Joe Joyce ruled to have upended Steve Hodge. Scunthorpe didn't like it, the referee didn't care. Mel Sterling scored from the spot. Then two goals in the last quarter of an hour wrapped it up. Carl Shutt set up Lee Chapman for his first goal in eight games, relief for the big striker. And it was Shutt's dummy from Batty's cross that gave Gary Speed the room to make it 3-0. Flattering for Leeds and tough on Scunthorpe, whose luck, or rather lack of it, was summed up late on when David Hill hit the woodwork. 3-0 on the night and 3-0 on aggregate. 